Freak, you've been training. What's it like? Charlie, it's like coming home from school and your family moves. <laughs> so you knew exactly what G.R. Reed's going through in his next prank. Yeah, that's what made it so much fun. <laughs> we went to Charlotte where Hornets point guard Muggsy Bowes played the point man for our practical joke on his buddy J.R. Muggsy invited JR over his house for dinner with his wife, Kim. JR was sitting back, relaxing, watching some TV when WCCB sports anchor Jerry Valancourt broke in with a special report. The story, a big trade involving yours truly and the Hornets, got JR's undivided attention. Earlier in the day, we had cameras in the bookcase and the fireplace to catch all the action. Hello, everyone. I'm Jerry Valancourt. We interrupt your regular programming for this Sports Talk Sports exclusive. Rumors have been circulating throughout the NBA of some deals that might be taking place. Well, Sports Talk has verified a big one. Rick Mahorn will become a Charlotte Hornet. What? This was learned about 20 minutes ago. But in return, the Hornets will be giving up their number one draft pick from last year from the University of North Carolina, J.R. Reed. That's correct. This rumor has been verified. We have verified it with the front Marco. office from Philadelphia as well as Charlotte. J.R. Reed will go to Philadelphia. Rick Mahorn will come to Charlotte. Oh, uh, man, get out of here. here. Oh, the what? Of the hour. This has been a sports talk. You call my mom, man. No, that. What? You call my mom. <laughs> that don't work. What? No. Hey, I'm going to go out on a limb here and bet JR doesn't get through. That's because Muggsy had the phone company set up all the lines to ring busy. Oh, man. I don't believe this. No. Now I know busy. He's probably trying to call me. Are you sure you want to Man, they said something about that, but I didn't think it was going to go through. Hello, everyone. This is Jerry Valancourt with an update on a Sports Talk exclusive. The rumor no longer is a rumor. It is a fact. Rick Mahorn is leaving Philadelphia, who will become a Charlotte Hornet. Now, what does Philadelphia get in exchange in this trade? They get J.R. Reed, Charlotte's number one draft pick from last year. As always, when there is a trade of this magnitude, you get two different types of reactions from both camps. We had the opportunity to speak with Rick Mahorn at one of our studios in Philadelphia, and he had this reaction when he learned he's coming to the Tar Heel State. You know, I'm really upset. I feel that the Sixers really got a bad trade right now. I feel that when they get JR, he's a talented play player, but he can't hold the line. He can't do the things that I can do. I'm just really disgusted with the whole thing. And what are they going to call him, bump and rump now? You know, things like that and really upset me. Who do you think got the best of this trade? I think Charlotte has the best of the trade because I'm going to Charlotte and I'm going to be a proven player. You don't have to really worry about J.R. Reed because I don't think he's that tough. You think J.R. will fit in here in Philadelphia? Only way I think he can fit in if they put a shoehorn and let him get between the lines or something. Let him get through, but right now I just really can't talk about it too much. He pissed off though, man. But what about Charles Barkley? Take a look at this and see what you think. I just can't believe it. It's terrible. He's terrible. You know, Rick is thumping on bump. I thought we were going to be uh, great together for a few more years. Now they bringing this young kid in, uh, I don't know. Who do you think got the better end of the deal, Charlotte Warner or the Philadelphia 76ers? Well, I, I think Charlotte probably, you know, got the better end. They're getting an experienced veteran forward, and we're getting a little kid who's not ready yet. All right, Charles, we know you're very upset. Thanks for taking the time out to talk to us. You're welcome. Just a bad, bad trade. Sorry. So there you have it. Congrats. You're going to cry. <laughs> J.R. Reed can reach his full potential playing in Philadelphia. We will have more details on this Sports Talk exclusive right after this message. Call 976-KMO to hear exciting telephone results from the Charlotte area. See us describe themselves and give their phone number so you can... Oh, man, we got to go through this again. What? Muggsy's pretending he has no idea what's going on, and I think he might win an Emmy for his performance. There's going to be some more trades, too. It's gonna be some more trades. Well, why would they do that, though? Hello again, everybody. See. Jerry Valancourt. If you're just joining us, this is a sports talk exclusive. A player that became very close to J.R. Reed during his first year here as a Hornet, Muggsy Bogues, had this reaction to the trade. 
I mean, it's just always something about Jay. You know? He's always late to practice. There's always something in, in, that about his car is always an excuse. And uh, I think we just need to get this behind us and move on and, and get a veteran player like Rick Mahorn in here. One thing about JR, he don't know that he's on the pro basketball funniest pranks. Hey, buddy, you wonder why all the phones were busy? I got you. Back to you, Jerry. <laughs> hey, come on, we were just kidding. Hey, JR, sit down, relax, take it easy, because thanks to Charles Barkley and Rick Mahorn and pro basketball's funniest pranks, Yo. you've been the latest you victim. And on behalf of everybody, JR, we got you. <laughs> Oh man, y'all got me. Oh man, I was I was cussing everybody out as far as it is. Now the cousin, now the world is all left. You got me. Oh man. Hey, I see y'all. Now, Jay, how do you feel about getting all dressed up? Up and showered, ready yeah, to I'm go still out. going. I'm going somewhere. I'm going to eat. I'm going to eat or something. I'm just so happy to be in Charlotte. I can't stand it. <laughs> <laughs> Dinner on everybody. Everybody, let's go eat.